All seven states in the Southeast United States that we're privileged to represent are right to work states. We started a program, It's Wrong Not to Belong, and the thought process is that if you work in a facility, you need to be a part of that facility. And, and when, we're, when we have a union there, when we have a contract, a collective bargaining agreement, in order to make that collective bargaining agreement stronger, to make it to where the company respects you as a person and as a member, then everybody has to participate. To me, and to this organization, I think what it means to organize is to bring everyday members to come out of their shell and understand that they have something to contribute to their organization. Mabel McIntosh is, is absolute proof of that. Having a strong union helps with all the issues. I've been on the organizing campaign with the Pilgrim Pride local here. I'm in here trying to help this local to increase the membership. Just keep working and, and, and you'll, you'll pull your way out. I hope so. You know, the goal should always be 100% to be in a union facility and not be a part of it. It's just wrong. It's just wrong to want the same benefits, the same pay. You want the better working conditions, but you want to do it on the expense of someone else. You know, it's wrong. And so we just have to have the courage you know, to have that conversation. It is a hard conversation. It's not something that no one can't do, but it's important. Are you in the union? Uh, no. You're not? No. Organizing is all of our responsibility. It's something that we all can do. It doesn't take, you know, um, someone special to organize. It is absolutely necessary. It's something that we all have to do to ensure that our union is here for years and years to come. Sorry that that's the message that you've gotten, but that's not what we're about. Everyone, you know, regardless if it's right to work or not, you know, if you're part of a union, you need to be having that conversation. Sometimes it's just like a light that goes off. You know, when I'm sitting there talking to a person and when they get it, I see it. You know, I, it's like that, that moment when you know that what you said, you know, has resonated. And with every car, you know, it just gives you that fuel to want to get another one and to want to continue to share that story and encourage somebody else to do it. Organizing, that is the key to us being here for the long term. And it's easy, you know? It's just about having a conversation about something that's so important. We just got to get everybody to participate, everybody. When you meet a steel worker, like Mabel McIntosh, when you meet any steel worker, there's a drive in their belly that makes them want to help people. Mabel has the ability to bring that drive out. What any member can do is when they taste the success of organizing, taste the, the success and the difference that organizing can make, it'll go to the next member and to the next member. The ability to know that you had a positive effect on somebody's life, you had a positive effect on somebody's being, is the best feeling around. And it's what the United Steelworkers is all about.